Welcome back to another episode of Nate Tech. Today we're going to be going over a set of uh, Bluetooth headphones that I picked up here a little while back. Uh, There's a couple things that I really liked about them and wanted to, to check out firsthand. Uh, these brand, the brand is Macaw, M-A-C-A-W, and I will link that in the description of where I pur purchased them on Amazon. These are the TX80 model. Uh, a couple of the basic features that these have is they are Bluetooth 4.1 uh, compatible. And the the part that kind of really caught my eye, and it, I couldn't really find it in the description very much, but um, I don't remember where I actually saw, but these come with, if I can remember, I can always forget the name, it's called a MMCX connection. Um, it's kind of, or interface. Anyway, what that allows you to do is you can actually remove the headphone speaker from the Bluetooth wiring and, and mechanism and stuff. And I'll, I'll show you that here in just a second. So let's kind of show you the product. Comes in a pretty nice, nice box. And that is your McCall logo there. It's got a magnetic box. Inside, when you first open it, it actually has a really nice view. So this is, when you open it, that is what you see. So it's actually got pretty nice packaging. The headphones themselves, and these have different earbuds than what I'm traditionally used to. Get this one to pop out here. So it is. This is. These are a neck band style. Here's your your neck band. So you've got most likely your battery on this side, and then you've got your controls on this side. These are your earbuds. Hopefully it focuses decent for you. Anyway, it's got... Notice how it's kind of points off to the side there. But this connection I was telling you about... And these are magnetic, by the way. So they will connect together when they're around your neck. But this connection I was telling you about, that MMCX, you can actually disconnect. Hopefully this will focus good enough for you guys. Looks kind of like a micro um, coax connection. Is it going to focus or not? There's the other end. So here's your male end and the female. So theoretically, what this would allow you to do is to remove your earbuds if one gets damaged or you want to try a different style. You can separate it from the wiring and the Bluetooth processor. These do have a micro USB charger. Kind of disappointing there. I wish more brands would move towards USB-C. Even though I have a million micro USB cables, I'm just getting tired of them wearing out and just not holding up like they're supposed to. Okay, so we've got here on your to focus. So this is your play pause, volume up, volume down. There's a little red and blue LED. Tells you when you're paired or when you're in pairing mode and your mic is right here. So you can use these for phone calls. Uh, the couple that I've made have, the, the person on the other end has said that these sound really good. So no issues there. I would probably say my only complaint with these uh, they're comfortable around my neck. The only complaint, these, I would say, are a little lacking on the base side for my preference. Uh, you can hear it, but it just doesn't have that really deep, deep bass like some of your other headphones do. But that would be an advantage of these where they've got the nice Bluetooth you know, uh, processor and stuff, but you could swap out just the headphone using that MMCX interface there. So all in all, these are really good. I like the way they sound. I've used them on some phone calls, listening to music for a few hours. They claim about eight hours of continuous listening. I think it was a 300 milliamp hour battery, if I remember correctly. Uh, these are a IPX5 uh, water resistant rating on these, so they're good for exercising, things like that. Um, and you can tell, I mean, around here, it's got a really good seal 
around the battery side and even this one that's around your neck. So very nice, very good quality. Comes with a carrying bag, just a draw strap style. You do get another micro USB cable if you don't have you know a couple hundred already. And one other size of the earbud attachments. These ones, so the ones I had on there are the smaller style. And then these would be, these are the ones that came on it. This is the bigger, bigger size. And it actually, these are a lot easier to put on and swap than some of the other headphone ones, headphones that I've owned. But definitely a different style, but I didn't, didn't find any issues with them not wanting to stay in my ear. Uh, they were really comfortable. Uh, all in all, besides the lacking a little bit on the bass side, which is a personal preference, uh, everything about these was excellent. So I'm, I'm really curious. I, I would love to pick up, I'm going to try to pick up another style of headphones that have the same connection and just swap them and see if I notice any difference between them. So if you guys have any questions, post them below. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.